<lacht> sofort, sofort, sofort rein. So forget event. We have to pass an ID of an event that we want to get. And we can get the specific goal. We say get one goal. Pass in the ID. And then we say event. We don't need to do this actually. What we do need to do is we need to return um if I'm doing this right, double check and double check and double check it. Hey um get resolution. I think I just I did all of this within the function get one goal. Yeah. So we're just gonna return the data. So we're going to use the same format, except that we're going to make some changes. So, so we have the start date there, and we might need that, but we want a format to start date, or we want a start date. Let's call it, let's call it formatted, or format, date formatted. So we're going to call it date formatted. And we're actually going to format the date here. So the actual date is going to be LJS. You could look for this in PHP date format stuff. What we're going to do is convert it to a string that um that is readable. So remember how we have the dates, right? Like this, but we're gonna format this, format this, so it will look kind of like this, or exactly like this. So we'll test it and see. So that's date formatted. The next thing we need to change is we don't need to change anything else. We do need to change something else. Um, we don't have notes, so that's um. Let's get to notes. And finally, we need notes formatted. Notes formatted. And again, what this does is converts it converts any spaces to page breaks. So that allows it to show properly in HTML. But in a normal element, we just want line breaks. I'll explain that probably some more. Anyway, we're going down to here. We're going to say get get event. We're going to put the content type to JSON. We're going to echo get event. We're going to pass in the ID, which we now need to get. So we need to get the ID. We could say if ID, and this is just what we really do focus on is error um, handling because it's somewhat advanced. Although a lot of the things we do are pretty advanced, or at least well thought out. But um, yeah, we at some point you're gonna have to take error handling very, very seriously. Anyway. So yeah, so we should be able to get the event there. And so once we open, once we click on show goal, what we actually want to do is get an event and um, then show. So we could do it all inside here actually, you know. So we could say get server.php action for get event. We pass in the ID. Oops, where we get the ID from? That's a good question. Someone is paying attention, and then we can get the event here. We pass it and we're using JSON and code. So, so after we do, then then we open the model. So what we're gonna do here is so goal title, goal description, stuff like that. We're just gonna set that right. So we have. Goal title. We're going to set the text to the event title. 
called description. Then you set the text to the event description. Um, call is it called date? We're gonna set the text to format. Um, event for formatted date date formatted. And that's how I had it because it had um. And I'm confusing myself. Date formatted. Notes formatted. Date formatted. Formatted. Um, for notes, what we want, um, cool notes, we want to set it to HTML and we're going to say notes formatted because this is the HTML ready version of notes. And then after we, um, so we can add get assign event to elements you could say get event from server right so, so all of this is get so far minus the spelling errors you might actually have something going here oh so one thing we forget is the id current event is a good now all right so check this once we click on our no i don't need to do it like that one second show goal so what i could do here i think i could just pass an id now if you remember so that you don't get confused we give the event id first so we are just passing in the id that we received from the event this is wrong that's better so going back to the server when we say get events we pass in the id so we just take in that id and pass it into show goal so this would actually be ID. So what we're doing above with active current event. Yeah, we, we get to that. We're jumping ahead. So let's see if this works. This is me doing. Yeah, I didn't expect it to work. Actually, it could be because um networking so we're not passing back anything but we get them get event so let's just check out our server i think it's a really stupid error post i have get all right i was debating whether or not i should change it to post well, I guess leaving it like that is harmless. Mm. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, so what we need to do is we need to encode it. Get events. So let's do it like that. So in get event, we're going to actually encode it here. So that what we're returning is a JSON, JSON array. Um, my first goal, my second goal, third of December, Friday, fourth of December. Does this not look good? Let me get her. That's gonna add some um, stuff in the notes. I have a lot of um. I need to learn the first goal. So we just added some notes there. So we're going to reload the page, although that probably doesn't matter. I need to learn the first goal. So this is, this is really good.